Hello again. Right, now we're going to make our David's hops. You should have had a silver plate, okay, and some pins and some rubber bands. Now I've cut a hole out of my silver plate and what I've discovered is you need to not make your hole too big. So what I did was I drew around the bottom of a mug and then I cut that out very carefully. Be very careful with the scissors. And you can see I've already put a couple of split pins in place. And if we turn it over, you can see how I've opened those out. When you've done that, if you want to make it safe, you could put a little piece of sellotape over the back so you don't catch your fingers on it. So what we need to do is put about three. If you've got more, you could uh, do more. But we've got three each of these pins, okay? And we're going to put them in place there like that. Then we turn it round and very carefully, because they're quite sharp, open it out and flatten it down. See? Like that. And then do one sort of a similar sort of place underneath. So somewhere around there, I think. If you just twiddle it round a little bit, it will eventually make a hole. I'm doing the plate rather than the pin. There we go, like that, okay. Now if you cut your hole too big, as I discovered, it all collapses in. But hopefully then what you should be able to do is take your rubber band, put it around one of the top pins, you may have to just push it out a little bit with your finger at the back, and then round that one at the bottom. Okay, I've put that one in the wrong place, look, it should be at the bottom. There we go. We'll try again. There we go. There we are. And we'll try another one. So go round the top. And then round there like that. Can you see? And the last one. There we go. And we've got a hole. Can you? Can you hear the different notes it's making? David used to play the harp and he used to play it for King Saul when King Saul was in a bad mood. I wonder if you play a musical instrument or if there's something you enjoy about music. Do you have a favourite piece of music? Do you have a favourite messy church song? We'd love to hear what they are because then we can include them in our celebration times. So... Enjoy your David's harps. Don't annoy everybody at home too much with plinky plonking them. Okay, and maybe you could try different sized elastic bands to see if they make a better noise or they're not as effective. Have fun.